Well, hello, everyone, and welcome to Wednesday Worship. This is a Christmas edition, and uh, I want to wish you all a very Merry Christmas. I know uh, all around the world people are busy. It's been a busy week, a busy season for all of us. But my prayer is that during these days, we would not forget the true meaning of Christmas. And there are those who don't want to celebrate Christmas because it's not exactly the day. I I get all that, but I'll take any opportunity to tell the story that God sent his son, Jesus, Emmanuel, God with us, Uh, Matthew Chapter 1, verse 23, you shall call his name Jesus, which is Emmanuel, God with us. And what does it mean for God to be with us? This is what I want you to focus on during this Christmas season. God with us, we, we talk about it every Wednesday worship, almost every Wednesday. Uh, I talk about Psalm 22, verse 3. God is enthroned on the praises of his people. And when he is with us, he is here to heal, to save, to deliver, to provide for every need. That's what it means to have God with us. Amen. So my prayer for you this Christmas season is that you would experience the presence of God. Amen. This is a song I haven't sung for years and years and years, but I thought it it sets It sets a good tone for what we want to talk about today. Christmas is about His glory. Christmas is about His grace. Christmas is the gift of love our Father gave us. More than just another story About a special time and place Christmas is the time to lift a song of praise For God is with us And we celebrate the glory of His presence Christ has come Fill our hearts with love He came to save us King of kings and Lord of lords His name is Jesus God with us Emmanuel has come Angels fill the night with singing God is reaching out to man, bringing us a gift of hope in Christ, our Savior. More than just a time of giving, this is God's eternal plan. And Christmas is the reason we can sing again. For God is with And we celebrate the glory of His presence Christ has come to fill our hearts with love He came to save us King of kings and Lord of lords His name is God with us, Emmanuel has come. God with us, Emmanuel has come. God with us, Emmanuel has come. Well, 
welcome all to uh, this special edition of Worship Wednesday. We're glad you're joining us today. Uh, trying to focus on Christmas today because uh, Christmas is just in a few days, and I know you're busy. But uh, in the middle of all the busyness, uh, first of all, let me wish you a very special Merry Christmas. But in this season, uh, there are a lot of people, uh, you know, Christmas should be a season of hope. And yet there are a lot of people uh, going through this season. Maybe they've lost a loved one, gone through a divorce, uh, just lost a job, just uh, any number of things that can make this a, a really a lonely season. And I pray that God would use each one of us to bring uh, hope to those who've lost hope this season. Maybe across your street, could be just around the world, could be the person you work with every day. But uh, let's try this year to make this Christmas a true season of hope to those who have lost hope. Uh, this is a song, again, I haven't sung it for a long, long time, and I usually do it with the band, <clears throat> but I'm going to try to do it. It's called A Season of Hope. Prophet told us long ago a child will come to bring us hope. A star lit up the night to show the way. For all the wise men seeking truth, the child came as living proof. The light of all the world still shines today. In a lowly cattle stall Love was born to save us all It's a season of hope A season of joy And it all goes back to a baby boy When God reached down and changed the world forever We can reach out we can believe in the power of love we can all meet a need and love can change the world forever behind the lights and the christmas cheer people try to hide their fear Many hungry hearts are lost and cold But we can be the light of Christ Bring some joy to someone's life And share the greatest story ever told In a lowly cattle stall Love was born save us all it's a season of hope a season of joy and it all goes back to a baby boy when god reached down and changed the world forever we can reach out we can believe in the power of love we can all meet a need Love can change the world forever. Yes, it can. Love can change the world. Love can change the world. Yes, it can. Because we are His hands and we are His feet. Across a thousand miles or across your street. We are His hands. And we are His feet across a thousand miles or across your street. We've got a gift, let's give it away. May 
make a difference today It's a season of hope, a season of joy And it all goes back to a baby boy When God reached down and changed the world forever We can reach out, we can believe In the power of love we can all meet a need And love can change the world Amen. Love can change the world forever. So this Christmas season, let's try to be a blessing blessing to someone. Reach out, be the hands and feet of Christ to someone in need. Just a a smile, um, a thank you, bring in a special meal to something to just uh, let people know that there really is um, a reason for the season. And that reason is the light of Christ living in us us. Amen. So, um, you know, it's interesting that Christmas time, excuse me, I think about, I wrote a song called uh, My Christmas Prayer, and we're going to sing that here, but after I left Integrity Music, um, after 20 years of being there, excuse me, just get a drink of water. Uh, we left and moved to Nashville. And I'll tell you what, it was a uh, kind of a scary time for me um, uh, because I left uh, a salary. I left all my friends and, uh, man. So uh, I was, <laughs> I, find, I find myself in the middle of July in 100 degree uh, temperatures singing uh, this song. Be near me, Lord Jesus, I ask you to stay close by me forever and love me, I pray. Can you believe it? But that's the prayer that was in my heart. Be near me, Lord Jesus, I ask you to stay that's your prayer today. Uh, you're going through a lonely time, a challenging time, and and uh, I found myself singing um, away in a manger. Th- that, those words, uh, be near me, Lord Jesus, I ask you to stay close by me forever and love me, I pray, in the middle of a hot, hot summer day. But that's what I prayed, and I sang it over and over again. So as we <clears throat> came to working on a Christmas album called A Season of Hope. Uh, I wrote this song with uh, David Hamilton. It's called My Christmas Prayer, and I'm going to ask Rachel and Tom uh, to help me sing this. of the city shine bright red and green but sometimes the season is not what it seems in heartache or joy let me rest in your care be near me Lord Jesus this is my grace Shepherds bow down, the angels were singing their glorious sound. I have no great riches, no gift to impart. What can I give you? I ask you to stay. 
Through the storm, through the night Hold me close, be my light Show the way Bless all of your children We need your embrace We hunger for mercy And long for your grace Our grateful devotion Is all we can bring We praise you We bless you Jesus our Savior and King Be near me Lord Jesus I ask you to stay Close by storm through the night hold me close be my life through the storm through the night hold me close be my life show the way Great is the gift just to know you are there. Be near me, Lord Jesus. Be near me, Lord Jesus. This is my Christmas. Reading from Luke chapter 1, verse 30. Then the angel said to her, Do not be afraid, Mary, for you have found favor with God. And behold, you will conceive in your womb and bring forth a son and shall call his name Jesus. He will be great and will be called the Son of the Highest, and the Lord God will give him the throne of his father, David. And he will reign over the house of Jacob forever, and of his kingdom there will be no end. Then Mary said to the angel, How can this be, since I do not know a man? And the angel answered and said to her, The Holy Spirit will come upon you, and the power of the highest will overshadow you. Therefore also that Holy One who is to be born will be called the Son of God. Now indeed, Elizabeth, your relative, has also conceived a son in her old age, and this is now the sixth month for her who was called barren. For with God nothing will be impossible. And I want to say that again. For with God, nothing will be impossible. Then Mary said, Behold, the maidservant of the Lord, let it be to me according to your word. And the angel departed from her. There's a couple things I want to talk about here. Those last two uh, scriptures. Number one, for with God, nothing will be impossible. Whatever you're going through right now, according to what you can see in your bank account, according to the word from the doctors, I know it can bring fear to your heart this Christmas season, but hear this word from the Lord. For with God, nothing will be impossible. Okay? And then Mary said, be it unto me according to your word. In fact, I I wrote that up. Be it unto me, according to your word, according to your promises, I can stand secure. Carve upon my heart the truth that sets me free. According to your word, O Lord, be it 
it unto me. And, you know, we, we, we talk about that a lot on these Worship Wednesdays. Be it unto me according to your word. Uh, the Bible says God's word will not return void, but it will accomplish the purpose for which it is sent. And that's why we sing his word. Uh, Heal me, O Lord, and I will be healed. I am the God that healeth thee. This is God's word and his, his promise. And uh, when we put his word on our lips and submit to his word as Mary did, we become pregnant with the word of God in our spirits. I mean, think about that. So I want to encourage you this this, uh, season. uh, Pray like Mary prayed and just, just say to the Lord, be it unto me according to your word. According to your promises, I can stand secure. Carve upon my heart the truth that sets me free. According to your word, O Lord, be it unto me. Yeah. According to your word, O Lord. Be it unto me. Did you know that your baby boy will one day walk on water? Mary, did you know that your baby boy will save our sons and daughters? Did you know that your baby boy has come to make you child that you deliver will soon deliver you. Mary, did you know that your baby boy would give sight to the blind man? Mary, did you know that your baby boy would calm a storm with his head? Did you know that your baby boy has walked where angels trod when you kiss your little baby you've kissed the face of god Great 
that your peace would come and rule and reign in every heart today. In our towns, in our churches, Prince of Peace, come and rule in our world. We pray specifically for Israel. Let your peace rule and reign over that situation. In Jesus' name we pray, let your peace come and rule and reign in the world tonight. In Jesus' name. in the 
desert will I see Heaven and earth will fade But His word will still remain That's right And He will do something new today Oh God will make a way Yes He will Where there seems to be no way He works in ways we cannot see He will make a way for me He will be my guide Hold me closely to His side with love and strength for each new day He will make a way He will make a way with love and strength with love and strength for each new day He will make a way He will make a way will make a way for you. Thank you, Lord, for making a way where there seems to be no way. A roadway in the wilderness and a river in the desert. And we thank you in this Christmas season for making a way for each of us by sending Jesus, your son, as a baby, Thank you, Lord. And I pray now that the Prince of Peace would come and rule and reign in your heart. If you've never accepted Christ as your Savior, what a great time to invite him into your heart. Just pray this prayer with me, dear Jesus. I believe you are the Son of God. You came to this earth to save me from my sins. I am a sinner and I need a Savior. Come into my heart. Let your peace rule and reign as I surrender all to you today. Come into my heart. I choose to follow you. Thank you, Lord, for the miracle of Christmas. Thank you for touching broken lives, broken hearts, bringing broken families together this season. In Jesus' name, let your healing flow through each one today. Be healed in the name of Jesus. Oh, come, let us adore. Oh, come, let us adore. Oh, come, let us adore. Christmas to all. Thank you for joining me for this special edition of Worship Wednesday. Pray that you have a blessed uh, Christmas season, and I look forward to seeing you again next week. Remember, God is always working in ways you cannot see. God bless, and Merry Christmas.